my name is Barbara. I'm in my second year of international relations here at the University of Birmingham. And today I'm gonna show you around Moseley, which is a lovely area located only 20 minutes by bus from uni. So Moseley was named the best place for city living in the UK by Sunday Times in 2015. And today I'm gonna show you one of my favorite cafes. Then I'm gonna show you a bakery we found and some parks where you can chill and relax. So the first location is Cannon Hill Park. This park is only 20 minutes walk from Sally Oak. It's a large park with lots of facilities and there is so much to do. You can try outdoor sports such as tennis or mini golf. There is a cafe and there is also a swan lake boating. It's a great location for walking, cycling or running. So I would definitely recommend this place, especially in this lovely summer weather. Then we headed into Mosley High Street. We walked around lovely neighborhoods with beautiful houses and we went to get vanilla ice latte. This place is called Java Roastery and it's a small independent coffee shop with the best coffee in the town. They also have gluten-free and vegan cake options. If you haven't tried Java Roastery coffee yet, you definitely should. A few meters from Java Roastery, there's an amazing bakery and coffee shop called La Brioche. It's literally one of the best desert places in Birmingham. There are so many cakes and pastries to choose from. Also, if you are going to a last minute birthday party, they offer these ready to collect cakes. So I would highly recommend this place if you fancy a sweet treat. Then we wanted to visit Highbury Park, which is located on the borders between Moseley and Kings Heath. And it was a great idea to go there. It felt like a piece of countryside in the city. It's a huge park with plenty of areas to explore. And although it was my first time there, it definitely was not the last one. So I hope you got inspired and visit Moseley soon. It's definitely worth visiting, especially throughout summertime. And see you soon. Bye.